Hi everyone, this is Catherine. I'm coming to you guys today with a quick tutorial on my everyday look for the summertime. This look, I call it the summer glow look. You can wear it every single day and still look really, really nice, but nothing too dramatic. If you're interested in finding out how I achieve this look, please stay tuned. Okay, as usual, I'm gonna start off with my eyebrows on. Um, today's eyebrows are just light, more natural, less dramatic. And then you use a facial wipe to cleanse your face just to remove any additional unwanted oils. After cleansing your face, um, today I'm gonna use my Prep and Prime Fix Plus. This is to hydrate your skin. Once that dries, I'm gonna use my Lancome Primer a face primer you only need a little bit it's a serum so it spreads everywhere today's foundation will be studio fix fluid NC 45 by Mac Just simply spread this all over your face. Today I'm using MAC 190 brush. It's a foundation brush. I'm just simply applying it all over my face. I'm gonna take my Beauty Blender. I'm gonna spray it with my Prep and Prime Fix Plus. And then I'm gonna use that to help blend the foundation all over. Be sure to blend your foundation in with your through your hairline. Okay, next I'm going to use my Sigma E60 brush. And I'm going to use this with NC30 um, concealer by MAC. I'm going to blend out the concealer with my Beauty Blender, again using the Fix Plus. Because my dark circles, my bags are so heavy, I do use um, quite a bit of concealer. Now I'm going to use my Prep and Prime transparent powder to set under my eyes. Under my eyes. I'm going to use a different beauty blender and I'm simply going to dip it in there. Knock off any excess powder so you don't want to look chalky. And then press into where our concealer was applied. You do this because you don't want your makeup to crease. Whatever's left over, I'm just going to dab up here in my T-bone. After that sits for a few, like a minute or so, I use this brush by MAC. The numbers have kind of faded away, but I use this brush as a 130 or something like that. And I simply just dust off whatever powder hasn't set. Next, I'm gonna use my Mineralize Skin Finish in Dark. And to apply this, I'm gonna use my Sigma F40 brush. Next, I'm going to apply um, a slight highlight using my mineralized skin finish in soft and gentle. And I'm just gonna use my Archie's 
um, contour and brush. Now with a smudger brush, this is by MAC, but the thing chipped away. I'm going to contour alongside my nose. With my Archie brush, I'm going to use this gold, let me see, I don't know the name of it. It's made by L'Oreal Paris and it's called Glam Bronze. I've had this for forever. You see how much they, they gave me? So I have no clue where I purchased this at. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's called Twilight Gold, but it says Glam Bronzer. But anyway, I'm gonna use this. When you open it, like there's a lot right there, but I don't use that. I always use whatever to touch the top. And I'm gonna dab this in here. I'm gonna knock off the extra powder. And I'm going to go up along my contour, like right in between the contour and the highlight. Just dab it on there slightly. Now this is a big huge blush brush from um, the Archie collection, but I'm going to use this to kind of dust, dust off whatever's left because I don't want it to be a, a lot of bronzer. If you want to add cheeks, meaning blush, feel free to do so. I'm going to do it today. You don't have to. Today's cheek, I'm going to use this one. It's called Mocha Matte. So my blush, I'm just gonna use Mocha Matte. The brush that I'm using is an Echoes blush brush. I'm just gonna use a little bit because I don't want a lot of pinks or red tones in my face. Just want more of a tan, golden, bronzy look. Okay, for my eyes, I'm going to use Painterly. It's a um, prolong wear paint pot. I'm gonna apply this with my finger onto my eyelids. Next, I'm gonna use my E Sigma 70 brush to apply caramel from the Amrezi palette in the crease of my eye. From the Adorable Palette in NYX Cosmetics, I'm gonna use this brown, the one without the glitter. I'm gonna use this to add some depth to my eyes here, using the same brush. Using a clean smudger brush, E55 from Sigma, I'm just going to try to blend that. Using a flat Echo Tools brush, I'm gonna use this light color here as a, as a highlight. And then I'm gonna blend it down. Okay, usually everyone would use like a black eyeliner. Today, I don't want the look to be aggressive. So I'm going to use Max Bountiful Brown. And I'm gonna use this as my eyeliner. So then I'm just going to apply mascara. I thought I was gonna do a top liner, but I'm not. You can definitely do one. So next, I've already prepped my lips with the EOS Mint Lip Balm. I love this stuff, it tingles. But I'm going to line my lips with um, Strip Down by MAC. And then I'm going to pair that with um, Viva Glam 2. If you want to add like a little shimmer, um, 
I like to add, uh, what is this called? Get Rich Quick. It's one of their lip glasses with the sparkles and stuff in it. See, I've used it up. I mean, I still have some in here, but I'm not gonna do it today. I just want it to be kind of a neutral, natural summer glow. So I'm not gonna do all this razzle dazzle on my lips today. Um, one thing I would have added, but I decided in between doing the video that I wasn't gonna do it, you could do like a light brown liner up here and that would be cute. Now everything's done, it's all set on my face. I'm going to spray my matte finishing spray as my final touch. Let this dry and you're all done. This is my summer glow look. This is literally my everyday summertime look. I love eyeshadow so I have to put something on my eyes. Um, but it doesn't have to always be dramatic and bright. And I just like to look like kind of bronzy, you know. So even though I don't go outside and go get crazy tans and stuff. I hope you guys like this look. Um, it's really easy, really simple to do. So if you guys have any questions, I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you so much for watching. If you have questions, please feel free to shoot a comment below. I will respond back as soon as I possibly can. And... Don't forget to subscribe. See you guys later. Bye.